This message from our glorious Sophia has been translated into American English. Hello, men, women, and good children. As you all know, I am the Lafia of the greatest nation in the universe. The great and glorious nation of the kingdom of Pagiria. However, there are some in our borders who would like to disface that greatness, who would like to deface that glory, who would like to disface our honor, the honor of being in this great and glorious nation. And those, and the ones who are in question are doing such a treasonous act. Are the citizens who are involved in the workers revolt of a few weeks ago, if not a month ago. And I stand by the words that I said. Then that they were as they have become greedy. They have become greedy. After all. I gave them all they want. I gave them their own union. I, I, I gave them what they wanted. I gave them a seven hour work day. What they demand. And yet, they still rebel. That, my dear citizens, my beloved citizens, my loyal citizens, is what is known as workers greed. It's very common among workers. In fact, you don't even have to look that far, my dear citizens. All you have to do is look at America. All you have to do is look at America and see how they, how would you say, operate. How, how their workers do, if you will. How they constantly, no matter how much of their demands they receive, they always beg for more. They are always wanting more. They always want more than they need. That is an example of workers' greed. My dear subsistence. And we shall not go down the path of degeneracy that the Republic of the United States of America has gone down. We will continue to follow the pure, fat, the pure path rather, that we have followed to ensure the everlasting unity and strength of our great Unglorious nation. For a great and glorious nation, for ten thousand years and onward, till the end of time. For if we go down the path of the Americans. Our nation would certainly crumble. You want to know why? It would certainly crumble because they allow degeneracy to run their nation. They allow it to thrive in their nation. Now you might be saying, what degeneracy are you talking about? I am talking about democracy, my right dear citizens. Democracy is a inherent is an inherent 
degenerate ideology. It is always bound to degenerate. That also goes the same for other ideologies, such as communism and socialism. Those two other ideologies are also bound to fail, bound to fall into degeneracy. My dear citizens. And so, we will not go down those paths. We will not go down those paths of degeneracy, my dear citizens. We will stay down the path of purity to ensure the strength of a glorious nation forevermore, my dear citizens. To ensure that this universe falls under our will, my dear citizens. And, my dear citizens, we are the masters of this universe. We shall unite this universe. We shall also unite this universe under our flag. It may not be in my lifetime, my dear citizens, but I assure you, my family's dynasty will unite this universe under one nation, under one king, and not one king, sorry, under one nation, under one flag, and most importantly, under our ideology, my dear citizens. For if the universe is not put under our ideology, it will surely collapse under degeneracy. And we wouldn't want that, my dear citizens. So, as always, hello, Bulon. Hey, Bulon. I just want to remind you to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the future. And as always, hello, Bulon.